Hey guys, Gizmodict here and this is a tutorial about routing the Moto G4 Plus and installing a custom recovery on it. I have the Indian variant of the Moto G4 Plus and I will be following a guide that's given on xdadevelopers.com. Before starting this method, make sure that your Moto G4 Plus model is supported and also take a full backup of your phone because this will wipe the phone's data as well as the internal storage completely. First of all, we need to unlock the bootloader of the Moto G4 Plus. For that, you need to download the drivers for Motorola phones as well as the ADB and Fastboot drivers. All of the important links are given in the video's description so you guys can refer to them and download all the required files. Install the Motorola drivers and also unzip the Fastboot folder. Now head over to the Motorola website and create your account. This is required because you need an unlock code from Motorola to unlock the bootloader. Log in after creating your account and keep the tab open. Now on your Moto G4 Plus, go to About Phone and tap the build number a few times. This will create a new developer settings option. Open it and select OEM Unlocking. Make sure that the OEM Unlocking option is switched on. Now switch off your Moto G4 Plus. Hold the volume down button and the power button for a while. This will boot the phone in the bootloader mode. Now connect the Moto G4 Plus to your PC and open the fast boot folder that you downloaded earlier. Here, press shift and right click and then select open command window here option. This will create a command window. So now in that you need to type M fast boot OEM get underscore unlock underscore data and press enter. You will get a long string as the output. Copy this string and remove all the bootloader tags. Copy the resulting string in the Motorola website as you can see on the screen right now and then generate an unlock code. Motorola will send this unlock code to you via email so do keep an eye out for that. Once you receive the unlock code, make sure that your Moto G4 Plus is connected to your PC in bootloader mode. Now again open command prompt in the fastboot folder and type mfastboot oem unlock followed by the code that you received in the email and then press enter. You will need to enter this command again. So once you enter the command twice, the phone will reboot and now your bootloader is officially unlocked. Set up your device and once you are done doing that, it's now time to root the phone and install the TWRP recovery. Download the recovery file, the root zip file and the super su zip file from the links given in the video's description. Copy the super su zip file to your phone and then copy the recovery image file and the root zip file to the fast boot folder that we created earlier. Once again, put your phone into the bootloader mode by using the power and the volume down buttons. Open a command window again in the fast boot folder and now type fastboot flash recovery followed by the recovery name.img. Press enter and this will install the teamwin recovery onto your phone. Now move over to the root zip folder that we downloaded, extract it and then run the root.bat file that's there inside the folder. A small pop-up window will appear and disappear quickly on its own. Now on your Moto G4 Plus, press the volume buttons until you get to the recovery option and then press the power button. Now your phone will reboot into TWRP. Go ahead and install the super su zip file that we copied earlier onto the phone. Once that is done, reboot your phone. And once your phone is rebooted, go and download the super su application from the Google Play Store. Now your Moto G4 Plus is completely rooted. Rooting the Moto G4 Plus can enable the LED notification light that's there next to the fingerprint sensor on the Moto G4 Plus. I already have a video showing you guys how to enable the LED notification light on the Moto G4 Plus, so do have a look at it. This was my tutorial about rooting the Moto G4 Plus. I hope this video has helped you out. Please do like this video and subscribe to my channel for the upcoming review of the Moto G4 Plus. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.